And hello, peoples. It continues. It continues. Um. So, day five, four, five. I don't even fucking remember actually. Um. And there's a squirrel. I don't know if you saw that. Um. Yeah, he's sitting right here. Oh, he rolled. He went over the gate now. Uh. Anyways. Uh. Love you. I don't want to keep doing the videos in the same damn spot every day. Perfectly honest. I don't know how you can. Uh, the one thing I always killed me when I sell daily vlogs is like, oh, we're gonna do a daily vlog. We're always going somewhere different. I'm like, how do you? How are you this active? Like all the goddamn time, they're just active as fuck and they're everywhere. And I'm like, I mean, yeah, the popular channels. I don't even understand where they're getting the money to do this. People say, well, they're getting the money from the daily vlogs. I'm like, dude, you don't get a check at the end of the month. You tell me you're spending your month's check just going to random places. Some, like, seriously, have these places. Don't even make sense. And, you know, some of them are actually for videos. Some, some of them are just going fucking places. I'm like, where, where, do you, <laughs> where do you find the time and money to go to all these different states and shit, or just countries in general, and have the finances to fund these expensive-ass trips? I can only imagine how much... I mean, plane tickets going to different states in America are costly. So I can only imagine how fucking costly they are uh, to go to different fucking countries. Because the thing at that point, you have to get a passport and all that other dumb shit. And that depends on because you have no choice. You must fly in those situations. You can't... There is no... Oh, I'm, I'm not going to fly. I'm going to drive. Yeah, you drive over the Atlantic Ocean, motherfucker. <laughs> or the specific... Not specific... Pacific Ocean. I always fuck that up. I always go specific because I was around idiots and idiots said specific instead of Pacific. So there's that. Anyways, um, honestly, I don't necessarily have a vlog topic for today because um, today is my off day uh, in terms of gym. I think I take like one day off a week from gym and then I go back like the rest of the other six days. Um, there's a broken basketball goal we've had for a while now, actually. We've had this thing for years. There's a bird next to it, too. Anyways, uh, so I've been kind of chilling. I mean, I haven't, like, been just gorging, but, you know, just chilling. Um, currently, I'm trying to work on my second review and making decisions of what the fuck I want to do with the other review I can't upload because Toho wants to be a dick. I think I might just bite the bullet and just fucking upload it and dispute it and hope to God it works. Because I hate, I hate, I, I know how certain YouTubers feel when you up, when you spend like, see, I don't spend ridiculously long on videos. I think my, my anime reviews are probably the, anime reviews, the It's Animes, and the fucking Looking Backs are the ones I spend the most time doing uh, shit on. I never really clock it, but if I had to really think, Looking Backs take me at least five to six hours. Not even, and it's, not, and 90% of it is the editing process. Now, have I scripted my shit? Please. Uh, by the way, those the, the it's anime and the looking bats aren't scripted. They're just well, no, they're not. They're not. They're not scripted. I may think of a general idea of what the fuck I want to do, but they're not actually scripted. Uh, it's actually pretty insane. <laughs> considering the, the amount of praise I do get for those videos, considering I don't spend the time to script them, it's kind of crazy. Anyways, um. The point I'm trying to make is that, you know, if I if I spend as much time as some of these bigger YouTubers spend, which is like days upon days of shooting shit, and then you're like, I can't upload my review. The back of my mind is like, fuck you, I'm uploading my review. I mean, luckily, it's anime review, so if copyright shit even ensues, I have the option of uploading on Crunchyroll. Well, I do anyway. What I mean to say is, you have another way to watch it. And it's not like Crunchyroll stops you from watching anime reviews because of a fucking paywall. No, you can... You can still watch reviews, you know. Uh, that's why I keep linking the new, the engaged, the unidentified review on there. And it pissed me off because I was actually really proud of this one. Because I came up with a good few a few good jokes. Uh, if you were on my Facebook fan page, you already saw that awkward picture, which would have tricked a lot of people into thinking, well, what the fuck is he reviewing? People thought, oh, it's, it's, it's Astaroth's toys. Like, no, that's just a really bad gag I'm doing in the beginning of the video. And I'm kind of mad. That's one of the reasons why I'm mad. It's like when you, <laughs> that's why it's like, it's like when I spend all this time and effort to, into a video and I'm like, I can't upload it. I'm like, this is bullshit. <laughs> and then I think about if I had spent six or seven days on it and I'm like, oh, this is bullshit. 
Actually, that video took a while to make because I had already recorded the review maybe like two weeks in advance. But, uh, due to some stuff on Crunchyroll's side, I didn't get the clips, or the, the uh, clips, the anime clips, to use in the review until, like, way later. Like, I didn't get the fucking clips for it until, like, a week or two after the fact because of some stuff that was going on. Which really makes me mad about the fact that I can't fucking upload it. Because it's like, well, look, you can't upload the fucking review because of the clips that you spent two weeks waiting to do the fucking review for. So a lot of these newer videos I've been doing, like the last, I think, two or three have just been on-the-fly videos. Um, and in terms of weekend plans, because it's Thursday as I'm recording this, um, I think I'm going to watch JoJo tomorrow, get my hair cut, and probably... Uh, I don't even fucking know. I need to cancel the Hulu thing that will eventually turn into a paid subscription. Because, you know, when Neon, when Neon Alley went to its free model, you know, if as a Hulu, you know, you got the whole two months of free Hulu Plus. Which, by the way, isn't really fucking worth it if anyone pays for that. Because if you get Hulu Plus, guess the fuck what? You still have to sit through ads anyway. So I'm like, what's the point of me having a Hulu Plus account? That doesn't even qualify, that doesn't even have, that still has ads on it. It defeats the fucking purpose. It's like, here's the Hulu Plus experience. And there's like three or four ads in a goddamn episode. Which is bad, because I actually did spend like the first few days browsing on it. And I thought, and I, the thing I thought, I thought about Hulu is I thought Hulu would have like more anime in which I could watch. Like, I could watch the adult version of shows without actually having to subscribe to, like, Funimation's Elite Video subscription. Particularly because I don't want to do that, because I'll end up buying their box sets. Like, I think they just released, well, they, they just released, that they're releasing, I think, a Devil's a Part-Timer and Bento. And I think I said this yesterday, actually. So, you know, I, I'm the type of dude who, am, oh, look, there's a bird. I don't know if you can see it. The tree is obstructing it. I was like, nope. You can never get close to an animal when you're intentionally trying to. <laughs> but you can when you're not trying to. That's why I end up walking near squirrels and not realizing it until after the fact. And actually, one last thing before I go. Um, fucking bring up squirrels. Here's a question. Are squirrels like daredevils? I, I want to know this as a general question because I think they are. I've noticed a lot when I'm driving... When I drive through my neighborhood, or just driving through a neighborhood full of trees where squirrels would reside, squirrels, for some stupid reason, will be sitting there at the goddamn, like, they'll be sitting there in a safe zone, like, they're on the goddamn sidewalk or some shit, and then intentionally run into the road as they see a car coming to, like, see if they can cheat death or some shit. And some of them bait you. Some of them play chicken with your ass. Some of them play, uh, uh you think you're gonna hit me? You think you're gonna hit me? I mean, it's, it's pretty much a, a, a fucking game in which either you move first or the squirrel moves first and the squirrel usually fucking wins the squirrel ends up being the bitch in almost all situations but they bank on you being a bitch and i'm like you know what squirrel this is why we don't fucking get along because you keep trying to duck and shit it's like i'm not trying to kill you that is not my fucking goal but you keep bringing your ass out here in harm's way to fuck with me eventually i'm gonna just be like you know what i'm going to intentionally come and get you <laughs> granted that's animal cruelty which is why i don't do it also, last thing, uh, I've been seeing a lot of fucking possums. Hey, by the way, I've lived in the South my entire life. I didn't start seeing possums until my, like, mid-teens. What the fuck is up with the possums all of a sudden? Anyways, I'm going to stop vlogging. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Vlogs again for your boy Terrell. Peace out.